Hello everyone. I'm going to show you easier steps to use Holy Cloud Meeting as an enterprise meeting administrator. There are five main steps. Let's start. Step one, after you have purchased Holy Cloud Meeting service, you will receive an email with your cloud meeting password from Holy Cloud, like this one. The account is your email address. Copy them and click Login to the platform. You are supposed to change your old password into new password that you can easily remember. Finally, we come to the management platform. As the enterprise administrator, you're responsible for managing conference resources and the meeting users. You need to do some settings before you use cloud meeting service, and you may want to confirm what resource you have got. Let's check together. Come to the enterprise management. Click overview. You can see I have one cloud meeting room and five IDEA hub access accounts. Click to view details. Everything is correct. Step two, let's add a department and manage meeting users. For example, I'm going to add a sales department. Click Save, then add users for this department. You can choose to add one by one or import in batches. Here's a template. You can download and fill in the template, then upload. A large number of users will be added to the list here. The system will send them an email notification automatically. You can also choose to add an external users here. Step 3. If you have purchased an Adia Hub Access account, you can follow my steps to add an Adia Hub activation code. Come to the hardware, Huawei audio hubs. On this page, enter a name for your audio hub. You can name it whatever you like. Let's name it 123. Put in your email address. Click Save. You will receive an email with your activation code later. At the same time, you can find the activation code by dragging to the right. Here you can see. Then use your activation code to activate your Adia Hub. Step 4. I will show you how to manage virtual meeting rooms. We call it VMRs. Come back to Enterprise Management, Cloud Meeting Rooms. After the VMR is allocated to the user, the user can initiate meetings as the VMR meeting administrator and perform meeting controller operations. As you know, I have one cloud meeting room. I can allocate the VMR to a specific user or an audio hub. For example, I'm going to allocate David a VMR. Click here, choose David, click OK. Finished. The system will send David an email with account and password to Huawei Cloud Meeting. And David can use VMR to start a meeting now. We can also reclaim VMRs for users or other hub by click here. Step 5. The final step is optional. We are the default administrator of our enterprises and have all permissions. Why a standard administrator has the permissions other than purchase packages and adding administrators? So if you want someone to help you manage the platform together, you can choose to add a standard administrators. Click administrators then add and choose one for your meeting users to act as an administrator. That's the end of this video.